Right now, a Valley group is working to help stop you from becoming the victim of identity theft. Channel 5 Cecilia Gutierrez talked to the Better Business Bureau today about tips on how you can protect yourself. Recent events have Susie Bouchelle on edge when it comes to her private information. Um, I just recently had a uh, credit card charge that I didn't make, so things like that pop up and you, you realize how vulnerable we all are. She says since the incident with her credit card, she's more aware of where her information ends up. That's why she came out to shred documents like old bills and tax forms at the Better Business Bureau's biannual shredding event. Things that I didn't feel comfortable recycling. President of the Better Business Bureau, Dolores Salinas, says today's event was in honor of National Secure Your Identity Day. Salinas says many people become targets of identity theft after information gets thrown away in dumpsters or an old computer hard drive doesn't get erased properly and ends up in the wrong hands. I have heard of a business that got rid of a, a computer with not, without it being properly erased and someone took the information and actually cloned their business. This is why the Better Business Bureau wants to encourage you to shred sensitive financial documents and dispose of old electronics the right way. You should hang on to it till you can dispose of them properly, either through one of these events or, like I said, solicit the services of a company like Lone Star Shredding and Document Stories that do this on a daily basis for businesses and consumers. She says if you can't get to a shredder or an event like today's to keep any documents with your information on them until they can be disposed of properly. Selena says if you find out if you are a victim of identity theft to visit the Better Business Bureau for steps on how to recover your identity. The next shredding event is scheduled for sometime in April. In McAllen, Cecilia Gutierrez, Channel 5 News, this week.